this is to try and run through what I'm going to do in my mind, but not play it in front of you. I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. It's not going to be very long, but I'm going to see if it should work. I always forget that you don't have the sort of advantage that I do, where I have my whole set written down. When I'm going to, like, break and whatever. Oh, like. so, so do you have, like, uh, the music and everything in front of you? or No, like, so like, I, don't, I don't go that far. Okay, well, I wasn't sure. No, some people do, and so... Or do you have like your set list like written down like where you can see it if you need to? Just, I am like, yeah, like, that's exactly it. Is I have my set list written down. Oh um, no, no, I just I just kind of go uh, okay, and then this song yeah, that's not in the same key, so that works because it's not the same key twice in a row. So uh, I guess <laughs> we're doing that. That one didn't gain a warm response, so I'll cut that. That one's new. I want to promote that. So that's basically what I end up doing. Yeah, you know, I just I have. A huge Excel sheet that's got all of my songs that I could possibly play on it, and basically I hit shuffle and put songs in order of how I want them. Are you good? Or do you want to just keep going? That was really good for no practice. 
Thank you. This is not part of the show. Uh, what I thought, I thought we were going in the direction of uh, Hero by Enrique Iglesias, which is really funny because I haven't heard that song in probably five years. It's 6.02. Do you want me to let the peasants in? Sure. I suppose so. Yeah. AB, are you, are you good with us? One second. Are you okay if we let people inside? Yeah. Fantastic. You can't see me, but I am wearing fishnet stockings and shiny purple booty shorts with my website across the butt. And then I'm wearing sweatpants. I'm I'm the dad in this thing. I'm like the I'm the Perfect. dad joke person. Yay! I need you to understand. This is for slashing for answers. I just don't have time to change before that, so now I just get to do a concert in looking like a slut. It's great. That is not a shame in any way, shape, or form. Status. Hi. Yeah. Do me a favor, just say echo. Echo. Nice. Reverb. Oh, Put it by there. You're the best. Can you believe it? There's actually people coming in. People want to see us, Citrine. No, it's not up here. It's over here, on, like on stage, <laughs> on the table. Is that on the table? I thought you meant that here on uh -huh. the table. Well, <laughs> clarify which table next time. What, what the fuck did you think I was talking about so, when I showed you So, welcome to Table Roulette. Um, All of us are confused and don't know how to describe tables. That's welcome to a convention at this point. Hard things that you can sit on. Yes. For those who, this is kind of related, for those who don't know, I'm in a very heated debate with Boozy Badger right now over the definition of pants and whether I have to wear them to first square. I have so much chaos planned, I'm so excited and I will not be wearing pants the entire weekend. You realize you're rooming with me and this intrigues the hell out of me. What'd you say, Sajun? I said, just now. Okay, sorry. I said, you realize you're rooming with me, possibly, uh -huh. it, first squared in like two weeks and yeah. this conversation intrigues me now because it involves me slightly yes um, no you can leave it off thank you we are technically supposed to be starting we are fashionably late now would you like to open or would you like me to open well i guess i can open um so we are, so my name is Citrine Husky. Hi, I'm Status Ferret. And together we are what I came up with this morning as United Huskies and Ferrets. So we are officially UHF. We'll keep what? trying to top each other. What, okay, ignore what I just. Yeah. Words are wrong. Leave it alone. That's for later. Uh, look, yeah, okay. That's the after panel. <laughs> that was oh, yesterday. God. Let's maybe not bring that back. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> uh, so yes, we are we are UHF. I had no idea that he was doing that, and I just lost my mind. That it was phenomenal. Ah. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll do my usual starting song. It's not nearly as special as that. Yes, Damn. Yes. Hello, hello. I'm not where I'm supposed to be. I hope that you're 
miss me Cause it makes me feel young Hello, hello Last time that I saw your face it was recess in second grade And it made me feel young Goodbye. I say to my best buds, we said that we'd keep in touch, and we did our best. All my new friends smile at party time, but soon we forget to smile at anything else. Won't you help me sober up? Growing up made me numb, and I want to feel something you help me sober up all the big kids they got drunk and I want to feel something again won't you help me feel something again how's it go again my favorite color is you your vibe You're missing me Cause it makes me feel young And hello, hello Last time that I saw your face Was a recess in second grade And it made me feel young And I want to feel something again I just want to feel something again that make us feel warm. That's true, it very much could be. Mm -hmm. So, I believe it's my turn now as to how we're doing this, we're just rotating I, I think we're just gonna go back and forth. I think okay. it's gonna be the easiest way. Okay, that works. Let's do that. So, uh, do you wanna hear a song that I've never done on stage before that I just like released like a day ago? Yes. So, it's my 15th album. Um, and it's about my dogs, um, again, so I anthropomorphize them because I'm furry trash. And um, so, so this was the first song off of my newest album, To My Dogs Part 3. So, gonna see if I can remember all this. Uh, but this is called Broken Toy Blues, so have fun with this one. Oh my god. <laughs>
perspective of your dogs that's so clever it's always fun especially they're just staring at you like what the hell is your problem see <laughs> I, I want to do that but my issue is my dog there is not a single thing going on behind those eyes so which is so great because he's running for town office uh, so he's perfectly qualified uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna dig myself out of this hole that okay. I just that I just gave myself uh, all right there's a song called stick season I didn't write this As you promised me that I was more than all the miles combined You must have had yourself change a heart like halfway through the drive Cause your voice trailed off exactly as you passed my exit sign Kept on traveling straight and left our future to the right Now I am stuck between my anger and the blame I can't face Memories of something even smoking weed is not replaced And I am terrified of weather cause I see you when it rains Doc told me to travel, but there's COVID on the planes And I love Vermont, but it's the season of the sticks And I saw your mom, she forgot that I existed And it's half my fault, cause I just like to play the victim I'll drink alcohol till my friends come home for Christmas And I'll dream each night of some version of you That I might not have, but I did not lose Now you're tired, try in one pair of shoes and I'm split in half that I'll have to do So I thought that if I piled something good in all my bed that I could cancel out the darkness I inherited from dad No, I am no longer funny cause I miss the way you laugh I once called you forever now you still can't call me back and I Cause I just like to play the victim I'll drink alcohol Till my friends come home for Christmas And I'll dream each night of some version of you That I might not have But I did not lose Now your tire tracks in one pair of shoes And I'm split in half that 
Keeping with the happy thing, or what do you want me to do? Are we gonna, are we gonna go whiplash on them? Do whatever you want. I'm gonna go full whiplash on my next one, so go for it. Okay, let's let's just give it, let's make them cry, make them laugh, and make them confused. Awesome. So this song was off my album that just released literally one week ago. So yeah, I go from one album straight into the next. Uh, but this album, this is the title track. It was called "I'll Never Drive Your Truck." Um, nice. For a tiny bit of reference. Um, it sounds like a comedic song, but actually my father just turned 75 on the 16th, um, and his health's not the best, so it's one of those things where me and my father have always been close, so it's that point where you always inherit something after somebody passes away and you keep the memories alive, but it's the reality that now every chance I get, I'll go fishing with him, I'll go anywhere that I can with him just because I know someday that's not going to happen and I can't keep the memory going.
the stories of the past The thousands of miles of travel In my heart they'll always last But some things can't be replaced And when you get called up I'll be choked up cause you're gone But I'll cry too cause dad earliest memories is riding in the back of my dad's pickup truck, um, which I think he wishes that he wouldn't let me drive because I've crashed it a total of four times. If he's listening, I've crashed it twice. So um, you're going to know this one if you want to jump in with it. Okay. Um, this is 1985 by Rolling Pursuit. Oh, holy shit. Doing it in the key of B, if yep. that helps you at all. It does. Awesome. One, two, three, ooh, ooh, ooh. No, my dad texted me. I had a panel right before this, and he texted me in the middle of it and gave me a damn heart attack because he just texted me, I need you to come home. I was like, oh, great. Something happened, and I'm eight hours away from home. His next message was, I'm out of paintbrushes and need you to go get me more. <laughs> Thanks, Mark. <laughs> Thanks, Mark. Thanks, Mark. Citrine, do you have something? Just 
Street, I love you. Like, I'm just going to animate your life with music. I suck as an artist. I can't draw. <laughs> oh my god. I'm sorry, it's gonna be the most boring life ever. Status attends college class for five <laughs> minutes. Status has a nervous breakdown. Status goes back to college class and has another nervous breakdown. So, Train, you got something? This is getting sad. Now I'm thinking of taking my classes online, getting my degree <laughs> online. So, see, you're throwing me. So, I have no idea. Um, I wish I knew the words off the top of my head, right? I feel like absolutely we're doing that. Working for an average wage. That's too real. I don't want to talk about it. Um, anyway, so I'm basically going backwards in my discography. So this was a song that I released in 2022. Uh, basically, my personal response to the whole just drama in general, I don't know, it just kind of got to me one day because my phone was reading all the drama and I was like, this is stupid. Um, but this song is just basically my straight up philosophy. And I swear, this song is political as I'll ever get, honestly. But uh, this song's called Shake Hands. Favorites of yours. I don't know if I've ever 
told you that. I love that one. Aw, um, thanks. So since you took it in a uh, political direction, oh, here we go. I guess I'm going to take this one in a political uh, direction. <laughs> so unlike the insanely talented Century and Husky, I cannot relate. Or relate. You can, wow. Oh, I can't relate either, dude. I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm I, I cannot uh, um, release 15 albums in... How long have you been doing this now? Uh, my first album was released in fall of 2018. Oh my god. Fuck you. I've been doing music since oh, I could breathe and I put out one album. Look, I'll give you my room number later, whoever said fuck you. Uh, we can talk, so. <laughs> Sounds hot. <laughs> <odd. laughs> but I just put out my first album in August of uh, this past year. Ooh. I will have another one coming out this year at some point. Uh, but this was off of the first album and this is a song called Brussels Sprouts. I don't like Brussels sprouts They're green and they're gross I can't think of anything else That I hate the most I don't like racist people They're mean and they're gross I can't think of anything else That I hate the most The thought of both ruin my day The presence of either could ruin my ear Let's do the world a favor the Sprouts and racists can go the world would be a better place Without the taste of green And without the judgment of race I don't like Brussels sprouts They ruin everything they touch I could go my whole life without them And I really wouldn't miss them much I don't like racist people They ruin anything they're near The world would be a better place If they all just disappeared both of them are insufferable, and both of them serve no purpose. Let's do the world a favor. Sprouts and races can go. The world would be a better place without the taste of green and without the judgment of race. I've never liked hating things. I think everything deserves a chance. Maybe I was too hard on Brussels sprouts, and maybe I'll change my stance. Okay. I've never liked hating things I think everything deserves a try Unless, of course, you're racist yeah. Then you're not worth my time not? If you hate someone for how they were born You're the lowest kind of low Let's do the world a favor Sprouts and racists can go The world would be a better place Without the taste of green And without the judgment of race Um, so I have a song that I can't do at any other con because this is an over 18 con. I'm oh, so no. excited. Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! I thought you were about to play Blackbird. I was like, what the hell? Blackbird fly. No, that's a beautiful song. That's why I was like, why can't no, you play that at another con? No, that's that's the Beatles, are you kidding? <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, anything that I do is worse than the Beatles. They had hits. Um, but uh, anyway, so I did an album a few years back, um, actually I've done two at this point, but I call them con missions, so it's commissions that I get at cons. By the way, if you're interested in commissioning me, you can commission something like this for like a hundred bucks, or you can commission a love song, I don't really care, you can, you know, it's your money. Um, but, it's um, my money and I want it now! I need to eat, so... <laughs> <laughs> That's good advertisement. I'm Citrine. I can sing and I need to eat. Buy something. <laughs> Buy my shit. I need to eat. I'm making a sign like that. I'm just carrying it around. Um, but anyway, so somebody goes, I want you to write a song about all the swear words. All right. So this what? is, so look, money's good. Money talks. And apparently that Benjamin swore quite a bit. Um, so anyway, this was called the swear song. Why? I'm really excited. You, you're really? Okay. I'm, I'm sitting on stage. Okay. I'm not leaving. You just... <laughs> oh, God. I'm sat in front of the stage. If you get a lighter and start swinging, I swear to God, I'll step forward to make it a liability. <laughs> Yeah. 
everybody's got an issue with some sorry. And I guess that it never occurred to me. But when I got a commission, I thought now right there. That's a good reason to fill a song full of swears. All the words that I can't say, cause everyone gets offended every day. Kids are in the audience, they know better, they're fine. <laughs> that is amazing. Oh my god, that was that was that was phenomenal. Put that on Spotify. Yeah, there's a reason that my songs sometimes aren't on Spotify. I get paid more at fur cops, that's my demographic. Hey, now would be a good time since sometimes you can't find your stuff on Spotify. Where can we find you? So you can if you want to be cheap, which I understand life sucks. Um, then you can find all my stuff at Citrine Husky on YouTube, C-I-T-R-I-N-E-H-U-S-K-Y. Um, and I have like 600 and something subscribers, so I'm trying to get to 669 because yes. Nice. Um, as, <laughs> I'll be mad at the 670th person. Um, it's me. I swear to God, no. It's me. Hi. Hello. I'm the problem. It's, it's me. me. You're, you're, mm. uh, Sorry. <laughs> but uh, anyway, so... I do have my first eight albums. You can find some of them, um, some of my earlier material you can find on Amazon. You can find it on Spotify, some of my earlier, more mundane material. But if you're looking for basically a one-stop shop for everything, I have my first eight albums here. Uh, so basically my albums are $10 a piece or you can, I'm trying to get rid of some of them because they take up space in my closet. Um, so basically you can get all eight albums here this weekend for $50 instead of 80. Um, so you can get all eight of them for 50 uh, You can get a song commission for $100, or you can get, for $200, it's called My Forever Pass, which it is a custom cassette flash drive, and where the ribbon would be in the cassette, a little flash drive slides out, a USB, you plug it into your computer, and they are numbered. These Forever Passes, which I'll do my song forever later, these are basically a one shot. So you pay $200, and you get every bit of my music for the rest of my life, including what I've got. 
I've got like 1,500 songs in the vault, so unless I get laryngitis permanently, I don't plan on ever stopping. Um, so basically, you would just bring it up to me at a convention. You're in a database. It's numbered, and I just give you all the newest music. It's got a podcast. You can find out the juicy details of that asshole that that song was about. Nice. Um, and so, yeah. So that's my little spiel. Um, really quick while we're on this, do you have some stuff? You know, sure, I, I'll yeah, promote you know. some stuff super quickly. Okay. Um, I am on Spotify. Uh, you can find all of my stuff at uh, Status Ferret. I'm on. Uh, I'm. I am on YouTube, uh, and I am also on Twitch, uh, very sporadically. Um, I also have copies of my album with me, uh, and I also have CDs if you would like some, or if you don't want to spend any money. I also just have business cards where you can check me out. Um, it, I, you can also visit my website, statusferret.com, um, and you can find all of my stuff there. Uh, you can stream it for free. You can buy it. You can support me. I also have vinyls that didn't make it in time for this for this convention. Um, yeah, that's that's what I got. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We, um, God. Oh, I was just saying, yeah, basically, um, we can't draw, so we sing. Um, so if you want to use them, you know, we, we don't mind. If you just want some new Frisbees, you know, if, there you go. if, if you're yeah, a pup exactly. and you want some shiny Frisbees, free, you know, you, yeah, you know exactly. it, it works. So, you know, it's, it's fine. Uh, it helps us get noms, uh, which helps us get from con to con because we're not taking care of ourselves where the damn these days uh, at conventions. We don't yeah. sleep much. Um. Yeah. <laughs> I, I can't draw, but I do have a cricket machine now, which I is a power that I have and will continue to abuse. Hmm. My shirt right now Ooh. says candy is dandy, but liquor is quicker. So, Accurate yeah. points. Yes. Um, I'm going to take a complete 180 on this. Okay, That's go cool. for Awesome. It. This is a song I never get to do live, and I'm doing it in the original key, which I know I'm going to regret like as soon as I start it, but we'll figure it out. Whatever. This is a song called Dear Winter. Dear Winter, I hope you like your name. I hope they don't make fun of you when you grow up and go to school, okay? Because winter is a badass name. Dear Winter, I hope you talk to girls or boys or anyone you like. I just hope you don't stay in every night. Cause I wish I were out tonight. Oh, oh, oh. It really doesn't seem like there's anyone for me but dear. But shit, I gotta meet your mom first. Dear Winter, I hope you like this song. And even when you're 13 and you scream at me for parenting you wrong, I hope it's still a badass song. Oh, it really doesn't seem like there's anyone for me but dear. But shit, I gotta meet your mom first. Dear Winter, don't move too far away. And please don't say I'm hovering when I text you to ask about your day. I wanna hear about your day. Oh, will we still hang out and talk when I'm no longer in charge? But dear. But shit, you gotta ask your mom first. <laughs> Dear Winter, hope you like this song. I gotta find a girl that doesn't mind that I'm inside my head a lot. Winter, it won't be too long. First, I just gotta find your mom. This is a double shot, so I'm kind of doing two in one. Um, so, 
there is a person here who is on staff, and I'm rooming with them, so I'm going to rat them out. Um, hi, Odie. Hi. Hi, you're there. If you weren't there, this would be awkward as fuck. Um, <laughs> so, today is a certain yellow doggo's birthday. Woo! <laughs> and, um... A certain sweetheart of theirs, named Raz, um, had, yeah, I know, um, had me commission me to write a song. They said, don't worry about it, I'll write them a song just so that I can sing it on stage and embarrass them. Um, <laughs> so, rude, yeah. <laughs> but um, anyway, so this song is um, for Odie, and then I have a song at the uh, end of it because basically I wrote a song for Raz as well, and he didn't commission it, he just got one because that's what you get for being my friend. Yay! <laughs> so. He makes a stellar apple pie He loves Star Wars, but he's not on the dark side He's a fan of Mary's Frankenstein And he runs loop of sack hunts all the time Oh, he big old dash hound Yellow dog with a tongue hanging out. He's got millions of badges to hand out, and he makes his friends happy all year round. He's a Odie, 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 dirt, dirt dog. Millions of badges to hand out, and he makes his razzy happy all year round. He's a Say hello, bark, bark, then he's off in a rush. Doing all he can to help us. He's a friend to you and me. Running like crazy, causing a frenzy. In a blanket of red and white, he's so nice and friendly. Making the car. That's my friend Raz, the little hot pup. Whoa, oh, oh, little hot pup. Whoa, oh, oh, little hot pup. Whoa, oh, oh. Love you both. Happy birthday, Odie. Uh, since we're on the, the topic of friendship, I wasn't going to do the song on my set at all, but I Aww. guess we're going to do it now. Uh, this is a song that's actually never before heard anywhere. Um, it is going to be on the album that's coming out this year at some point. Um, one of the songs that really kind of put me, I don't want to say on the map, but kind of just kickstarted everything was a song that I wrote called The Promise. Um, which was about a promise that I had made to a friend of mine that I would save my uh, first drink for him on my 21st birthday. Um, and that man has kept me sane through the craziness that is this fandom. And this is one, this is a song that's more um, specifically talking about that. And uh, this is The Promise Part Two. I also really hope I remember the words to this. You good? What? Said you good? I appreciate you. And I'm also doing this because I know he's not in the room. <laughs> <laughs> I was sitting on your floor with some tequila in my hand, trying to forget the moment that the whole world caved in. I 
already forgot the words. I love this. <laughs> Just wing it. That's pretty much what I'm doing, yeah. <laughs> I didn't feel like crying because that's usually not my speed. Another shot of alcohol was all I really need. And those... Fuck. Sorry. <laughs> God damn it. I could... There's a blank there, and I know the next line is... And in that moment, I always knew the friend I needed was you. Have fuck, that's not the right chord. <laughs> have your age and have your height and have your wisdom too. Opposites attract, but the same can also do. What we both are built on is a promise made for two. It took me 20 years to make a friend, and I'm so lucky that it's you. sheets to your door, an inside joke that we had made just the week before. Fuck, I'm so sorry. This went so much better in my head, oh my god. Well, I did say it was a sneak preview, so it's just kind of like one of those like YouTube songs that you hear where every 30 seconds it cuts off and like plays an ad, so that's exactly what that is. Wait, you'll get the chorus. And half your height and half your wisdom too Opposites attract, but the same can also do What we both are built on is a promise made for two It took me 20 years to make a friend And I'm so lucky that it's you When we're in the darkest times The time we find our light I'm so fucking sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> You're good. Woo! You know what? That was your preview. Thank you. I thought I knew that a lot better. I'm so mad at myself. Hey, I like this version. That was awesome. Thanks. I'm buying this song. That's real talent. Okay. That is the actual song that's going on there, just like that. Yes. Live from MCFC. That's the live version. That's the bonus track. You gotta pick. That's the bonus track. You're gonna pay the extra DLC for that! <laughs> How much? Oh, um, about 50 bucks? I'm gonna promote something super, super quick. Um, so, there was actually an extended version released of my album, Reinvention, where I did four songs um, for people who uh, uh, paid the top tier on the Indiegogo that I uh, uh, released. There are only 10 copies of the extended version in existence. Um, five of which went out to the songs uh, that were commissioned, um, and then there are two of them that are floating around this con. One will be auctioned off at Slashing for Answers tonight, Woo! at 9 o'clock in secondary events, so you should be there. I've got one of them. You too, I yes, think. Yes, I do. I actually did. I know, because that was 14 tracks. Does it have... It's like 14 or 15. I, look, I'm not going to lie. I ripped it and put it on my iPod. I'm fairly confident it's four. 14, yes. It's the full album plus four bonus tracks. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yep. yeah. You know what's funny? I, I can remember one of the bonus tracks now, and it, it would have gone way better than that. <laughs> Whatever I just did. <laughs> yeah, so. but that was better. See, that's attention. People are going to remember this, though. That's, that's the thing. I hope so. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I definitely remember it. Thanks. What you about remember? you, too? <laughs> you remember? I remember. I remember. I remember. I remember. I remember. The 21st I night remember. of September. Remember the oh, yeah, I remember. Okay. <laughs> All right, what do you want to do, Satrine? Um, so, you know, okay, I don't want to be sad too long, so do we want to kind of lump three sad songs in together? Go for it. Because I don't really want to cut any of these, um, so I'm basically going to do the first verse and the chorus of each one of them, because one of them was for uh, Lemonade Coyote, uh, which... Um, Rest in peace! It's been ten years. Um, but uh, then one was for Dog Bomb, and then during the pandemic, I uh, lost another friend named Skittle Fox. And uh, so I basically wrote a song for each of them. They're on separate albums, but I don't want to give you 15 minutes of heartbreak, so I'm going to sort of run these together and see how this goes and try and keep it together myself. <laughs> As 
some water after that jesus do the do the thing um i'm 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 gonna take it in a totally different direction uh that's fair i was gonna whiplash it too after you see so you're fine perfect 
Uh, this is a song also from the album. Uh, this is uh, one that I wrote after I received an ADHD diagnosis and understood way too much about myself and hated it. Uh, this is a song called I'm on fire but I'm fine. I'm also doing it in the original key because I think I deserve punishment after the last one, so this will be interesting. <laughs> I didn't believe Bo Burnham when he said my phone helps me dissociate and it give me a disorder when I'm broke. But now I'm sitting in the Starbucks line and I'm realizing I've spent my life as an NPC in someone else's world. Someone told me when I was 14 that there was a chance I might have ADHD and I didn't believe him because I was young and naive. But now I'm 21 and now that I'm a full adult My disorder is now my personality I'm having a breakdown and it's the best one of my life What's the point of trying to make everything right? The spiral's draining down so I throw up my hands and I enjoy the ride Believe me when I say that I'm wrong with me as long as I don't think. If I don't, then I don't have to be a person much at all. If you perceive me, then that's fine, but that's your fault. Believe me, I want nothing more than your expectations to be low. When I was young, my parents told me I was smart. And I took their words and I brought them all to heart. I never wanted to let them down, you see, so I lowered the bar so gently. And now I'm a store-bought man with ADHD. And yes, I'm still on that, it's my only personality. I'm having a breakdown, and it's the best one of my life. What's the point of trying to make everything right? The spiral's draining down, so I throw up my hands and I Believe me when I say that I'm on fire, but I'm fine, do do do, but I'm fine, do do do, but I'm fine. Now I'm stuck with finishing this song, and it kills me, cause what if I write something wrong? Will people still think of me as a well-rounded guy? I think that it's worth a try If I could ever make up my mind I liked it better when I didn't have to think or breathe or remember That I was alive I'm having a breakdown and it's the best one of my life What's the point of trying to make That's okay, we don't have performance as well. We do, but not singing. Exactly. Come to Question This tomorrow at 11.30 in secondary events. Where we won't sing. Yes. How much time do we have? What? We have 20 minutes 20. now. 20, okay. We want to do one more, and then we'll move on to our, our special things that we have planned. Okay, and we can do that. Um, are we doing the song that I always end with as one of ours? Or yes, okay. I had that down as one of ours. Uh, so, 
we'll, we'll do those. I'll make this one kind of short. And then what we'll do, uh, if you want, I have a thing that we can do at the end that I've never done before that might be kind of interesting. Okay. Sure. If, if you're okay with that. I'm not, try, I'm not trying to take over our show. Go for like, it. No, do the thing. All right. So in the meantime, I'll do something that I'm familiar with. Um, so this is my one furry song that you're going to get, uh, at least for the moment. And uh, this is called Friends Forever. Sitting all alone. Hey, I found the mic. Cause I didn't know nobody. Till a suitor walked up and said, Hey, buddy. Next thing I knew, I was at the rave. And I knew my life would forever change. And any time that I can have them up here to do it with me, it is an honor and pleasure. So, Citrine, are you ready? Yep. Let's do this. When I'm feeling lonely, sad as I can be, all by myself on an uncharted island in an endless sea. What makes me happy 
fills me up with glee. Those bones in my jaw that don't have a flaw, my shiny teeth and me. My shiny teeth that twinkle just like the stars in space. My shiny teeth that sparkle. Yes, they're all so perfect, so white and pearly. Brush, gargle, rinse, a couple of breath mints, my shiny teeth and me. My shiny teeth so awesome, just like your favorite song. My shiny teeth are puzzles, so they grow to be real strong. My shiny teeth, I love them, and they all love me. Why would I talk to you when I've got 32? Shiny teeth and me. Shiny teeth, shiny teeth. Keep going, sorry. <laughs> oh, no, you're fine. The shiny teeth that twinkle, just like the stars in space. My shiny teeth that sparkle. Shiny teeth and me. Shiny teeth, shiny teeth, shiny teeth and me. Shiny teeth, shiny teeth, shiny teeth and me. Woo! All right. Is that? That was Bluey's theme. That's what I thought it was. Look, I'm furry trash, and I'm a man. <laughs> You, you, you are, you are a man of culture. That's what that is. Okay, I was gonna say, don't you trash the Healer family? Come on. Oh, absolutely like, no, not. Uh -uh. You better not have trash the Healer family. <laughs> uh, 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 you want to move on to uh, more trash <laughs> meme songs? Oh yeah, I like trash. All right, let's do that. I'm doing that in the key of A, just so you know. Okay, cool. All right, you ready? Yep. <clears throat> Somebody once told me the world is gonna roll me I ain't the sharpest tool in the shade She was looking kinda dumb with her finger and her thumb In the shape of an L on her forehead Well, the years start coming and they don't stop coming Fed to the rules and I hit the ground running Didn't make sense not to live for fun Brain gets smart, but your head gets dumb. So much to do, so much to see. So what's wrong with taking the back streets? You'll never know if you don't go. You never shine if you don't glow. Hey now, you're an all-star. Get your game on and go play. Hey now, you're a rock star. Get the show on and get paid. And all that glitters is gold. Don't It's a cool place, and they say it gets colder. You're bundled up now, wait till you get older. But the meteor man begs to differ, judging by the hole in the satellite picture. The ice be state is getting pretty thin. The water's getting warm, so you might as well swim. My world's on fire, how about yours? That's the way I like it, and I never get bored. Hey now, you're an all-star. Get your game on and go play. You're a rock star, get the show on and get paid And all that glitters is gold Only shooting stars break the mold And all that glitters is gold Only shooting stars Somebody once asked could I spare some change for gas I need to get myself away from this place I said, yep, what a concept I can use a little fuel myself We could all use a little change Well, the years start coming and they don't stop coming Fed to the rules and hit the ground running Didn't 
it makes sense not to live for fun Your brain gets smart, but your head gets dumb So much to do, so much to see So what's wrong with taking the back streets? You'll never know if you don't go You'll never shine if you don't go Hey now, you're an all-star Get your game on and go play Hey now, you're a rock star Get the show on and get paid combine our closing songs, and by combine them I mean we're still doing both of them in full, we're just doing them together, because we both always end with the Are same we? song. Yes. Oh. Yeah. You, it, the, my, my closing song is, is the, the Weird Al one. Okay. okay. They're, bo they're both yeah. in the same key. I like it when they're yes, in the same key. Yes, they are. That is right. I forgot about that. Okay. Um, at least I do it in D. Uh, so anyway, I've been doing this song at the end of my sets literally since I was like 10. Um, do you want to do a quick promotion first? Just quickly? Sure. Cool. So, again, you can find me on Telegram and Twitter and YouTube at Citrine Husky. You have to come up and say hi to me because I am blind, but I'm very friendly. I don't bite. I would really love to meet you. I just don't want to be talking to a wall instead of you. So, feel free to come up to me. Again, my song commissions are $100. My forever pass to get you music for life, starting off with basically 150 songs, and there's three more albums coming out this year alone, um, is $200. I still have a few more of those with me. Someone bought one last night, so I've got like five left at this point. And then if you want my CDs, you can get each CD for 10, or you can get a full set of all eight of them for only $50. So 50, 100, and 200. Um, it really helps pay the rent. It really helps get me from to convention to convention. And I really do appreciate it. So if you can, uh, then it really does help. And a portion of the proceeds this weekend to my sales does go to the charity. So. Woo! Um, I am Status Ferret. You can find me on literally everything at Status Ferret. Please stop me at conventions. Say hi. Um, I will bite if you're into that. And um, uh, I have CDs and shirts for sale. Shirts are 20. CDs are 10. Um, I have the one album, so they're one for 10 or two for 20 or three for 30 because that's how multiplication works. And uh, if you don't want to spend any on money on me, I am on all streaming platforms, also as Status Spirit, or I have business cards if you'd like to hold on to them and look at them later and tell them pretty things. And yeah, uh, we're going we're gonna to end with um, two songs. This is the one that I always close with because uh, it is, it's a nod to my musical hero because he also ends all of his sets with this song. So this is a song called Yoda. <laughs> Nice. I met him in a swamp down in Dagobah where it bubbles all the time like a giant carbonated soda. A soda soda. I saw the little run sitting there on a log. I asked him his name and in a raspy voice he said, Yo. Y-O-D-A Yoda yo 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 Yoda Well I've been around but I ain't ever seen A guy who looks like a muffin but he's wrinkled in green Oh my Yoda Yo 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 Yoda Well I'm not dumb but I can't understand How he can lift me in the air just by raising his hand Stay away.
away from the darker side If you start to go astray, let the force be your guide Oh my Yoda, yo 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 Yoda Oh, no, no. 
here with all our friends in Motor City Fur Cup. Guys, gals, and non-binary pals, my name is Citrine Husky. I am Status Fair. We have been United Huskies and Ferrets UHF. Thank you so much. Enjoy the rest of your convention. Feel free to come up and say hi. And we really hope to see you next year. And we love you. Thank you. Man, you video that's not a jibe. All of you go to his YouTube channel and like and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs>